Here's an idea on how to use a cold timbers workbench. Use it as a bathroom vanity to add more storage under a bathroom sink. Just like this. Adding functionality and aesthetic design to a bathroom sink that was otherwise bare. Let's get started. I've assembled my workbench, just with the legs, and now I'm getting to measuring the exact height under the sink. Please note that these measurements will vary in different bathrooms with different fittings. Now I'm measuring the width and length of the pipe for my slot and also to see if the size workbench I have fits the space under the sink. Now I'm transferring the measurements of what my legs should be and making the cuts with my mitre compound saw. Next I reattach the legs so I can see if the table is at the right height and then I place in position and mark out where the pipe is sitting. Then I take the width into account and draw lines on either side of the center point. I am using a combination of a jigsaw and a handsaw to cut the apron part of the wood table, remove it so that I can get in there with my jigsaw and cut out that slot section. Following the lines and drilling two holes at the top of the marked out square there, helps to then remove that section out and now we have a slot that can go around the pipe fittings under the sink. Now I'm taking a sander and I'm just sanding the edges of that cutout slot as well as the surface and edges of the tabletop. I've removed all the sawdust and now we can get to staining this workbench slash DIY bathroom vanity. Add a clear water resistant sealer after the stain has dried. Here's the before and here's the after. Because the workbench legs were cut shorter, I just repositioned and reattached the slatted shelving. I can't believe what a huge difference this makes. Not only pleasing to the eye in a decorative way, but it's also functional and really, really adds warmth to the bathroom. We hope that you enjoyed this DIY project showing you how you can DIY a bathroom vanity without moving the sink.